What is going on, guys? All Things Mets Media here, and I'm coming at you with more breaking news. The Mets are looking to, you know, hire David Stearns in a high front office job for the New York Mets next season. So after the 2023 season, definitely the Mets are looking to hire David Stearns. This has been reported by Bob Nightingale from the USA Today. This is big, big, big news for the New York Mets for a team that really doesn't really have a baseball of operations, you know, president of baseball operations, as in, um, you know, uh, Billy Epler, he, this, he's not really the president of baseball operations for the New York Mets. You know, he, he's not really doing that great of a job. He's the GM. Just in general, the Mets don't have a guy like David Stearns, you know, um, at, at at the high office, uh, front office job, and you know that knows a lot about baseball. They really don't have that right now. So yeah, man, leave a like, comment, subscribe if you enjoyed the video. But man, let's get into this video. David Stearns, a guy that you know is a Harvard alum. This guy is 38 years old. Just in general, a little bit about him is you know from the 2018 season to the 2021 season. You know, you know, he was the president of baseball operations for the Milwaukee Brewers, and they were, you know, in the playoff for those seasons. So he is known for his acquisitions of Freddie Peralta, you know, his acquisitions of Christian Yelich, who is Christian Yelich is was an MVP, you know, just former MVP. So David Stearns know, knows a lot about baseball. And listen, last year, I know that the Mets reportedly they wanted to hire David Stearns. But they didn't have the permission from the Milwaukee Brewers to even talk to him. But he stepped down after the 22 season. And his contract is all the way up to the end of 23, 2023. So this is big, big news for a team that really doesn't have a, a, a president of baseball operations like David Stearns. A guy that knows a lot about baseball. Now, Billy Epler, you know, they're... they're we don't really know what's going to happen with the jobs of Billy Epler, of Buck Showalter after this season. But this is huge, huge news. I think David Stearns, if he comes to the New York Mets, definitely by the end of the 23 season and the and start of the 2024 season, I think he's going to bring a lot of ideas. I think he's a smart guy, and I think he knows what he's doing, and he knows a lot about baseball. So just in general, for a team that recently in the drafts, they haven't really drafted, you know, what they need to draft. Now, you know, in the last season, for an example, they drafted Kevin Parada, who is a really good hitting catcher, but they had Francisco Alvarez already in the minor league system. Now, they don't have a lot of outfielders in general in the minor league system, and they didn't go for outfielders. So, you know, they, they drafted a couple of pitchers, but not really high ranking pitchers in the draft. So, that's another example of the Mets not making really good decisions in that draft last year. But man, David Stearns, if he comes to the Mets, I know for sure, well, you know, I know for sure he's going to bring that baseball knowledge, that baseball attitude. And yeah, man, he knows so much about baseball. So I really think if he gets the chance to be the president of baseball operations, because we don't know if he's going to be the president of baseball operations for the New York Mets, we just know that he possibly is going to get a high ranking office front, you know, front office job for the New York Mets. And this is huge news. This is what you want to hear from, you know, um, this is what you want to hear from the Mets because Steve Cohen wants to make this team better. He wants to get guys. He's been wanting to get a guy that knows baseball for years. He's been wanting to get David Stearns for possibly two, three years now. So the fact that this is going to be a possibility, this is great news. And Bob Nightingale of USA Today definitely reported that the Mets are looking to hire David Stearns after the 23 season. This is great. This is what you want to hear from a team that, you know, you want this team to get better just in the draft. You want this team to get better just in the roster. You want to add, you know, flexibility. You want to win. You want to win at the end of the day. And yes, David Stearns, you know, as a president of baseball operations, he's never won a, a real, you know, championship. But he went to the playoffs with, with the Milwaukee Brewers for, you know, from the 2018 season to the 2021 season. So the fact that the, the fact that we're going to get a guy that hopefully, you know, the, the guy that knows baseball, this is what you want to see from a team like the Mets from Steve Cohen. This is what this is the news that you want to hear because we want this team to improve. We want this team to get better and we want, you know, 
better acquisitions. We want, you know, better choices, you know, so better options. So the fact that David Stearns is going to be hopefully with the New York Mets, this is huge news. Let me know what you guys think about David Stearns. Are you guys happy with this news? You know, he's 38 years old, so he's not, he's not relatively old. You know, he's not young either, but just this is, this is good news. I like what I'm hearing. I like that the Mets are finally, you know, going to be able to hire him because I know that they wanted to hire him last year. So let me know what you guys think. Do you guys think that they should hire him? Do you guys think that he's going to change anything? Do you guys think that Billy Epler should be fired? Do you guys think that Buck Showalter should be fired? Let me know in the comments. I love you guys so much. I love interacting with you guys. And yeah, this is going to be the end of the video. I love you guys so much. I love GM for life. This is where you get your latest Mets media. And I'm out of here, guys.